Hey, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can get IONOS email on Gmail. So the process is going to be integrated at the IONOS uh, domain, also the professional email that you have bought within uh, the domain uh, that you have bought also from IONOS to show up the email or the professional emails into your Gmail. So instead of having IONOS in here and open up a, uh, let's say here, the account of yours and then you're going to bother yourself by finding the emails from the professional ones that you have created it is going to be integrating them into the gmail so we are going to have everything in order so for beginners i do not have an ionus email but i'm going to show you the steps that you're going to follow up instead to have the access or put the access of ionus on gmail so Let's say that you have bought an account or not an account, but you have bought a domain and also a professional email. We're going to have the parameters of Gmail. So we're going to open up Gmail and from Gmail, what we're going to do is to click on settings. Now, once you have clicked on settings, what are we going to do? We're going to click on see all settings. Now you're going to be on the uh, settings, uh, as you can see here side. From the header in here, we have uh, filtering or the categories of the settings. From them, we're going to choose accounts and import. Now, you're going to see tons of words. You're not going to be impressed with that, of course. So, we're going to have here the keyword of check mail from other accounts. So, it is going to allow you to add a mail account that you're going to be having in this exact Gmail address. So we are going to consult, send, and view the emails. I'm going to click on add a email or an email account. Then you're going to type in the email address of your INOS. For example, I don't know here, jack at smith.com. Then you're going to click on next. After that, you're going to have the email account. You're going to have this only choice. Import emails from my other accounts, BOP3. Yes, we're going to click on next. Then we are going to have a username. So you're going to enter the mail settings for this one. You're going to have the username of yours that you're going to use on INOS, also the password. And here, as you can see, we have the BOP server. After that, you're going to have, for example, uh, some of the choices. Always use a secure connection. For example, when retrieving email, leave a copy of your retrieved message on the server. Label incoming messages at this, for example, or archive uh, incoming messages. And then you're going to click on add account. Maybe you're going to encounter some more steps that you're going to secure your account of IONOS in here, but it is going to be very simple. All you need to do is to read up the process or the steps. And here you have it. Basically, that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content. And if you find this video helpful, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe.